First, you fall in love. Then, you confess it. Ask anyone, and they'll say this is a wonderful thing. But they are so very wrong. Love is no game! It's war! Whoever gives their heart first will be conquered. Kaguya is an heir to a business conglomerate, meaning sex education wasn't part of her upbringing. Far from it. She was taught that people kiss, but that's all she was taught. Anything beyond that was a mystery that she didn't know needed solving. You're saying the stork doesn't get involved? The world surrounding her might as well be a windowless black box. So no, she has no idea what someone's first time means. That's who she is. But enough about her. Let's talk about the guy she's walking with. When did I get a reputation for being a ladies' man? Miyuki Shirogane, age 17. Dating experience. <laughs> right. This sucks. But sausages, omelets, hamburger steaks, pickled plums. She's never seen such delights. Oh, packet seasoned rice. All the cheap food one could want crammed into a tiny box. It was a mini treasure chest. Ocean versus mountains. An age-old argument people have been squabbling over since they found out oceans and mountains existed. While they carry on with these delusions. <laughs> Half a year goes by. Yeah, we're skipping ahead because nothing happened between then and now. There's a sense of urgency about them, and Kaguya hasn't failed to notice. When people think they're falling behind socially, it motivates them to do something about it, even if it means risking their dignity. By confessing their love, for example. Shinomiya, date me, please. Is this my chance? Oh, looks like someone found her objective for the day. I think you should ask me with more passion, don't you? Playing <laughs> innocent skill activated. <laughs> He's lost in the maze of his mind. Shinomiya's queen has Shirogane's king cornered, but he isn't out of moves yet. Two prodigies dueling with all their mental might. It's a race to devise a game-breaking strategy. Whoever forms a plan first will win! Power of deception, activate. Heartless. So please stop crying. No, hold on. It's too late. Oh, she memorized it! Though it was a fleeting glance, his profile pic has been forever ingrained into her hippocampus. <laughs> he lost the sole lace he had up his sleeve, which gives Kaguya the advantage. What a comeback! Why is she freaking out? <laughs> Are there naked chicks in that thing? And suddenly, Shidogane is very interested. Aren't you what most people would consider to be popular? She instigates. Yet you don't have a girlfriend. She do instigates you? more. Uh, well. Not right now. Good save. By saying not right now, Shidogane can imply he had a girlfriend at some point without outright lying about it. The word now has been abused in every language to dodge every manner of awkward question. Of course he's never had a girlfriend. I think it'll be fun. We're only 12 minutes into episode one, but I think we know her well enough to know she's lying. As if I would really go. Does she grow flowers in her head instead of brain cells? Yeah. Called it. I'll have to run your blind rendezvous by one of our teachers. The tattletale tactic. It's a highly effective but dangerous move, as the person who uses it risks being publicly shamed. But that's a risk the president is willing to take. He'll do whatever he must to prevent her date. That kind of determination demands respect. I didn't think he'd resort to such dire tactics. I doubt she's interested. What? Where would he get an idea like that? Was it something I said? Really? Oh, come on! In this game, keeping your mouth shut may be a coward strategy, but it works. A girl, her cat ears, and the bond between them. There are some things in this world that coexist in a beautiful way. Cats. The majority of people are fond of them. Schoolgirls. Shinomiya is, by all accounts, one of those. She's so cute! It's super effective. Well? Do you like the idea? So cute! Oh, he likes it. So cute! Cuteness! Why am I freaking out? He's just wearing a pair of adorable cat ears! Some might not think this look suits him, but Kaguya begs to differ. Kaguya uses tongue bite. It wasn't very effective. 
Her smile's not as big, but it's still there. This was but one battle in what will undoubtedly be a grueling war between two top students with their prides on the line. Results for today's battle. Kaguya loses. We've been through a lot together, so I'm sort of attached this to it. This is what happens when love clashes with intellect and runs endless circles around two people. Results for today's battle. Shidogane nullified a crisis of his own making, but just barely. It's his own fault she was pissed in the first place, so he'll take the L for today. Results for today's battle. Shinomiya loses. Some of her innocence. Results for today's battle. Fujiwara loses. Me, ouch. The results for today's battle. Cheek is weird. She isn't struggling with this for some trivial reason, like embarrassment or fear of being turned down. The reasons behind her hesitation go deeper than that. They're rooted in a myriad of complex psychological and so- Why does it even matter? Leave me alone! Sorry. But the corners of my mouth need to behave. Uh, here's an idea. Let's go for cheerful smiles. You can't do it. I want to see this little kid even closer. I want to burn this image into my brain!